today we're at Topolino's Terrace where their character breakfast is actually one of my most favorite breakfast in all of Disney World. So this we get to see Mickey and the friends in their artist outfit. We actually had a breakfast reservation at 12.15. We got here a little bit, bit earlier. And we were able to get in an earlier reservation. Works out really great. We're looking forward to uh, dining with Mickey and friends. Let's take a look at all the amazing chefs that work here. Assembling our breakfast. We've got some strawberries, some French toast, and of course the the Mickey waffle pop are always a crowd pleaser. This smells and looks delicious. Wow, that looks amazing. All right, oh, this, look, at, look at this. Beautiful. All right. We're ready to be seated and ready to enjoy our breakfast. Fantastic. All right. Let's check out the menu real quick. This is the Topolino's Terrace breakfast. Oh, breakfast cocktail. <laughs> and we have assortment of entrees. Let's see. There is a... Ooh. I think I had their quiche beer, which was excellent. I've got a toast. Um, Ooh, smoked salmon. Ooh, the butcher steak. I think that that's what, probably what I'm gonna go for. And you have a sermon of coffee. All right. And then I think this one has their specialty drinks. And um, Liz, the trees old fashioned. That sounds fantastic. Might be a little bit early, too early for that. Uh, at 10 o'clock in the morning and then they have the obviously the, the virgin version and the alcoholic version as well okay um yeah i think i'm gonna i'm gonna go with the wood fire butchered steak that sounds really good to me so that is the back of the menu i could just notice that there is a little mickey button this says like little pants button and his little little mickey head that's really cute oh what i really love about this little assortment of bread service is it, it comes in this like little painter's bucket and of course the uh, the accoutrement is kind of laid out in a in the palette shape so and then you have this little little paintbrush as your little butter knife which is always really cute. I have an eye in the Nutella and croissant so we're gonna go back a shot. Morning and salute. Super flaky on the outside and Really crunchy. Oh. It's a really airy, nice, nicely baked croissant. I get this delicious little chocolate muffin to try. It's so cute, and it's full of chocolate chips. Oh. Oh, I'm pretty happy. Last but not least, I think this is like an apple snow. Yeah, the apple tart is. It's super good. It's like not overly sweet. It's got a nice little, like that caramelly apple taste to it. A little bit on, a little little tartness, just gonna brighten it up. So, all in all, the the bread service, sort of your starter. <laughs> can't you can't um, go wrong with starting your day with a bunch of sweet bread. So we're, we're off to a good start. I think Mike and I have both. Decided we're gonna go with the Woodside Butcher Steak. They actually offered a couple of different substitutions. Instead of polenta, I got the roasted mustard potatoes and then adding a couple of eggs to it. I think Mike decided to kind of just keep the potatoes. Daisy, Daisy. Oh my goodness, how are you? Oh my gosh, how's the ballet lesson coming along? You're teaching it? Yeah, you look great. Last time when we were here, we couldn't hug the characters. We got to see them, so this time we actually get to hug them. Mr. Donald. Donald! You've been busy? You've been busy? You look like Sculpting? It. Been I don't know. What's, what's the late, latest masterpiece? Oh, uh, yeah, it's, it's looking, everywhere. You're looking oh, around for it? Oh, okay. oh, over there. Daisy, 
Daisy. Oh, uh, oh so nice. she's your perfect creation. Yeah, yeah, oh my yeah. gosh, I got you. And you're always number one. <laughs> always Breakfast is served. Oh my gosh, it looks amazing. Thank you very much. Oh, look at that steak. Oh, I asked for medium rare. And Mike's also got his uh, sunny side up. And like I said, mine is the uh, potatoes. There's uh, some mushrooms, some pepper. Oh, I can't wait to dig in. This is amazing. Let's just check out this beautiful egg here. Yep, that is perfectly runny and soft. Oh, all right. Look at that. Beef. Oh. I think I'm going to have one of these, one of the potato. No, the steak is nicely flavored, nicely cooked. I asked for medium rare and um, this is in your Pasalia Steakhouse or Steak 71, so but for, for breakfast, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. It's a decent, decent steak. You guys are so cute. Oh, many. Oh, 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 Okay, that's better. How's the painting? Oh, you're, you're the poet. You're the poet. Yeah, how's the painting? Oh, good. Yes, yes. You have these. And quill and everything. You, you got this. Your shoes. Always at the top of the Okay, Mike's doing a pro move. He's mixing his um, sunny side up eggs with that lovely tub of polenta. <laughs> oh. Well, that's when I. When I had the master plan for the sunny side up egg. Oh, this this turns turning out perfect. Oh I my gosh, look at that bite. This is what the polenta with the egg looks like. We're going to dig in. Dip a little bit of that steak into the polenta sauce. Good. Busy, uh, busy painting, I see. Yeah. Who does your laundry? I mean, like, do you just not wash them? Just, just because it's artistic. You're yeah. like, I don't care. I don't care. It's fine. It's fine. All right, Mickey. Let us give you a big old hug. Ah, uh, yes. Okay, we are just wrapping up our breakfast at Topolino's Terrace. Breakfast a la art, apparently. Mike, what do you think? It was really good. Every time we come here, I'm always really satisfied. The food's good, freshly cooked, made to order. The characters are great. It's the only place you're going to see them in their artisan Artiste out. outfits. Yeah, artisan outfits, so it's great. This one is kind of hard to get, so if you're interested, we do have a little video on how I typically get reservations. And in fact, if you are able to kind of find parking around this area, Skyliner over here, you can always try to do the walk up as well. That is an option. You know, parking is pretty limited. The cast member was being pretty strict when it comes to checking reservations and your ID. So just be very mindful of that. Always love the Riviera. It's just a beautiful resort overall. And the food is great. Characters are great. I We would definitely put Tobolino's Terrace, even at the price point as it is, is definitely something that is worth trying. So we hope that you enjoyed our little experience tour at Tobolino's Terrace. We'll see you next time.